has been over a hundred days since the U.S. Supreme Court overturned Roe v. Wade, the landmark 1973 decision that legalized abortion nationwide. In the latest, U.S. President Joe Biden has said that he will not let the Republicans enact extreme policies in the country. The U.S. President has announced new guidelines and grants to protect the reproductive rights of women in America. We're not going to sit by and let Republicans throughout the country enact extreme policies to threaten access to basic health care. And that's why we're all here today. That's why we formed this, this, this commission. I signed two executive orders, and my administration has taken a number of actions that this task force has, is charged to carry out. Now, U.S. President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris, along with several other cabinet secretaries, met with doctors from around the country with an aim to keep the issue in front and at the center ahead of the midterm elections in the country. Biden has already announced two steps that the White House will take to protect abortion access in America. In the first move, Biden has asked the Education Department to send guidelines to universities, reminding them that the federal law requires them to protect their students from discrimination on the basis of pregnancy, which also includes pregnancy termination. In the second step, Biden has announced that the Department of Health and Human Services will release $6 million in new funding to promote family planning services. My message to folks across the country who are worried about what we're seeing is, is uh, first that we have your back. We're not going to we're not going to step back from this. And second, we've heard your voices. So the latest move by U.S. President is built on existing efforts by the Biden administration towards protecting reproductive health care in the country. Earlier in August, Biden had signed an executive order that helped women travel out of state to receive abortions. In July as well, he'd signed another executive order that allowed safeguard access to abortion care and contraceptives. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.